Welcome to Ancon Network, where you get updates of things happening around you and things you would like to know. I appreciate everyone who has subscribed to this channel and those who are yet to subscribe. And if you have not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Click the red button and also click the bell icon so that you'll be notified anytime we publish any news. This time around, we have wonderful news for you that you'll be glad that you are aware of. Stay tuned. Imo State Governorship Candidate of the Action Alliance, AA, in the 2019 election, Uche Umusu, has declared that Governor Emeka Ihedioha has no plans for the state. Umusu said this in his reaction to Ihedioha's insistence that ex Governor Ruchas Okorocha did not properly hand over to him. The action of the governor since he assumed office has shown that he is not serious and does not seem to have any cut out plan or blueprints for governance except the desperation to grab power, also to the nation. The people of Imo State did not vote him to start chasing shadows. For the time he will stay as the governor, he should unfold his plans and program for the people. No one is interested in excuses. What the people want is performance and nothing less. The people want concrete statements on what the programs of the governments are, what the government intends to do and how it will deliver dividends of democracy to them and not embarking on a mission to pull down Rucha Sokorocha. The suspension of local government chairmen and their councillors, dissolving the recently inaugurated members of boards of government agencies and parastatas, and scrapping of recently established tertiary institutions is definitely a wrong way to start for a government that wants to make headway. One would have expected that by now the governor should have engage the civil servants and tell them what he has for the workers, as well as taking up from where his predecessor stopped. The acrimonies that could arise from these actions are hardly what Iedio had needed at this time. He should rather consolidate on the achievements of, the, of his predecessor. That is what Imolite wants to see. He should concentrate on the business of governance. If I were the governor today, I would definitely hit the ground running, knowing that there is job to do. Bravo! This is well articulated. Man, it is always good to be in the opposition. Very, very interesting. You can criticize anything. You can criticize anything at all. Even if paper is flying, you criticize it. If somebody raises hand, you criticize it. Wow! The way Uche Umosu spoke eh? one would have advised or suggested to Ihedioha to appoint a eh, Umosu as one of his AD or advisor. Man, the guy is good. But there was something he said. He said if I were the governor, I would have hit the ground running. Well my friend unfortunately you are not. So allow the governor to do what he wants to do at his own pace. I think he knows what to do. You are not you are not in the position to tell him what to do. After all, you were in the you were in the government house, and we could see how you ended up the whole thing, and we could see your relationship with your people. Allow Hedioha to do what he has to do, at any given time. He has the power now. He has everything at his disposal. He can use his discretion. So you don't need to tell him what to do. I can understand from Uche's corner. He's trying to defend his boss and his in-law so it is very expected of him to do that but i don't think a EADR has asked for too much i don't and i don't think he has gone beyond his boundaries so each of should just trade softly allow the guy to do what he wants to do and the most important thing the people the masses they love him they like EADR compared to you uh, compared to your in-law and compared to your your boss so you could see the relationship. You guys don't have good record. And it's really haunting you guys. So guys, that's just the way I feel or I think concerning what a Umosu has said. I would like to hear your opinion from the comment section. And let's dissect what Uchi Umosu has said. Thank you very much for listening. Bye.